Hey guys, this is going to be sort of an unstructured video, and right now I'm going to be talking a little bit about what I like in knives and what I don't like in knives, and I'm kind of interested in uh, what you guys feel about the subject too. Um, so there's a couple of aspects uh, when I look at knives, five in total, um, that I thought of for this video um, that sort of go into whether or not I select a knife to buy or not. And, well, I can tell, like, we'll generally judge whether or not, you know, if a new model comes out based on these factors. Um, I'll probably be able to tell whether or not I like the knife. Um, you know, there's some stuff you can't really quantify, like looks of a knife. Um, so I'm not really considering that, but there's just certain aspects of different knives. So let me just start from the right. One thing I do not like on my knives is um, assist. Um, this is the Kershaw Clash, which is a very nice folder. This one is a... Very good EDC high value folder, but I don't like speed assist. And the reason for that is I just don't feel it's necessary. Um, I really like to be able to control how I open and close my folder. And um, I just like to have a knife that is smooth, that is openable by my own, um, you know, under my own decision. Um, that won't get me into trouble with the police. That won't make, look pe uh, won't make people look at me like I'm a criminal. And, um, you know, I mean, knives are already probably uh, not PC enough as it is, but the fact that yours looks like a switchblade doesn't help at all. Um, so that's just my personal opinion. I understand there's that cool factor, but I know, I, I think the uh, the cons outweigh the pros. Um, and, you know, this, these aren't hard and fast rules, so occasionally I find a knife that will, you know, violate some of these rules, but I still like it. Um... But yeah, I don't really like assist because it gives that switchblade ki kind of feeling. And, you know, it just doesn't really help too much. And I like to have a nice folder that I can control in opening. Another thing I don't really like too much in my knives is a black coating. Um, I don't like black coating because it seems designed to wear. Um, and wear badly at that. Um, now, a lot of people may argue that the black coating protects the knife because it stops rust or whatever, but I put oil on my blades, and I don't mind doing that. But I find with um, a black coated knife, the more you use it, the less it's worth. Um, and that's much more significant than a satin, uh, satin blade because the, the, the black just wears so much. Um, you know, it just looks absolutely crappy. Now, I understand on the mud here, um, the DLC is higher quality than something like a Teflon from... Um, uh, cold steel, but still, it's going to wear, and, um, you know, that's just another thing. Um, another thing is that it just looks too tactical. I mean, um, I don't want to look like I'm a soldier. I want to look like I'm a normal citizen, um, and I just don't want to, like, I have no need to not reflect sunlight or anything, and I just find that it's just kind of, like, overly tactical. <laughs> I understand the design of this knife is tactical in and of itself, but... I just feel like that's a little bit of uh, tacticality, so to speak, that uh, so to speak, that you don't need. Um, so that's just another thing. Um, another thing that goes into whether or not I like knives is serrations. I don't like combo edges. I don't like full serrations on my knives. This one is a Spyderco ATR, and I really like this knife based on its design and. Um, other objective features like the, the lock. Um, it's because this design is so good that I take the serrations, but I don't really like serrations due to how they look and how they perform. They don't cut very cleanly, um, in my opinion, and though they may be able to do more rough tasks than something like a plain edge could do, um, the fact remains is that I don't really do too much tough stuff with my knife, and um, I don't really find it necessary. But I do think it's good to have one serrated knife in your collection, um, just so you have a little bit of variety. Um, but in general, I'm not a huge fan of serrated, you know, combo or full serrated knives due to the fact that I think they're less, they look worse and, you know, worse utility. Um, the last thing is the lock. Um, I'm okay with most locks except for one. I don't really like the back lock, or lock back. And that's just because I don't really like how it feels when it snaps open. I don't really like the, the opening and closing bias. Um, you know that doesn't exist on a liner lock, and it does exist on an axis, but it feels much better than it does on a, on a lock back, and it's like kind of springy, and I don't know, it just kind of feels funny, and um, I, I don't like how you need two hands, or you need to shift your grip in order to close the knife, I think that's um, not very efficient, um, 
and I just think they could have done that better. Um, you know, the lockback is a very strong lock, I'll agree with that, but again, I don't really put my knives, personally, to too much work, so I'm not saying this is what's for you, I'm just talking about for me, and I'm just wondering what you guys really think for yourselves, too. Um, but yeah, that's another thing, the lockback, I'm not a huge fan of, um, because, you know, it just feels kind of eh, clunky to me. Um, and that's basically it, um... If you guys can let me know what you like and you don't like in your knives, in this video I mostly talked about what I didn't like. Actually, the fifth thing was size. I like folders roughly in the three inch range because they fit my hand better and they're usually not too big for me to carry and feel uncomfortable with. But that's basically some of my views on knives and how I feel about, you know, when I'm going into buying these knives. And I actually think that all the restrictions I have basically are my, you know, peeves or. Um, what I don't like, um, they're actually beneficial for me because it stops me from spending all my money on all these knives that have, you know, serrations or black coating. Um, it helps me <laughs> limit my spending. So it's a combination of things. And um, yeah, so I was just wondering what you guys thought about the subject. Um, yeah, so let me know. Uh, see you guys. And uh, giveaway coming soon. Bye.